Show me your favorite position. How to eat a girl out. Motorboating girls for the 4th of July. Drunk girls on anal. Convincing girls to kiss each other. Do girls like getting choked? These are all investigative reports from the news channel Simple Sexy Stupid. I don't know what Simple Sexy Stupid is describing the, the channel or the host, but it did get me thinking about what my triple S channel would be. Hey guys, welcome to my channel, Sleepy Sarcastic sad. So Stupid Sexy Simple is one of those like pickup channels that helps guys to, to get with women. But the issue with channels like this is of course an attractive confident guy can walk up to chicks on the 4th of July holiday and ask to motorboat their tits. <laughs> I personally want to see a guy who looks like this approaching attractive women and going <laughs> Anyway, Simple Sexy Stupid showed up on my YouTube as a suggested video because they recently visited Australia to find out what our Sheilas think of American guys. You know, before we get into the video, I just wanted to have a deep heart to heart talk and talk about a secret of mine that I've never really talked about. I, I used to be really like depressed and... I'll admit this is a pretty heavy way to start a video, but I didn't want to pretend like he hadn't talked about mental health issues. So just get through the next bit and we'll jump straight into making fun of the guy. I was going through a lot and I remember one time this man on the street, he came up to me in LA. He had long hair, he might have been homeless, and he looked me straight in the eye. And from his pocket, he pulled out a brand new Vincero watch and handed it to me and said, son, wear this watch and you will get laid. What an asshole. I took that watch from the homeless man because I knew it was time to stop being depressed. Thank you, man, because ever since I've been wearing my Vincero watch, I look so much more attractive. I look sophisticated. I look intelligent. These women want sophisticated, intelligent men, boy. Don't use mental health as a way to sell watches dickhead so click the first link in the description use my discount code to get a discounted discounted vincero watch for you use my exclusive code to get a discounted discounted watch how can anybody be sad when they get 15 percent off a watch why would i buy a watch when he's already told us that homeless guys are giving them out for free. Now, please enjoy this Aussie video, mates. Cheers. Can't Hello. Hi. Greetings. Hi. Do you have names? What sort of question is that? Do you have names? You're watching a master pickup artist on the hunt right now. That's how you get women to talk to you. Just ask them questions that they can't say no to. Do you have names? Have you always lived on earth? Have you ever heard of math? Here today with my good friend. Ah, uh, Kelly. Oh, Ah, uh, Kelly. Breaking just now, sources telling CNN that singer R. Kelly has just been indicted. Real smart, R. Kelly, avoiding prison time by hiding out as a white Australian woman. Hello, everyone. Here today with this Australian person. I'm not Australian. What? I'm American. I wonder why he keeps interviewing her if she's not Australian. He's probably wishing it was 4th of July right about now. So the question is, who's hotter? American guys or Australian guys? I don't know American guys, so I got okay. Sample size, boom. Couple dashing Definitely. stallions. Definitely American guys. <laughs> R. Kelly, you traitor. That is treason. How could she choose American guys when right behind her, there's an Australian stud decked out in budgie smugglers. I really think it depends on the personality. So I think personality matters. Sorry to dodge the question there, but I think personality. What? I'm sorry, what? <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this guy is a cancer. Yes, to society, but judging by his tattoo, he's also an actual cancer. After he asks women if they have names. Do you have names? He follows up with, were you born in a month? I myself was born between the 21st of June and the 23rd of July. Do you, do you want me to prove it? I can take off my shirt. I'd go American as well. I'm thinking of like yes. Hollywood stars. Yeah, yeah, yeah totally. Nope, that's totally fine. Yep, Hollywood stars. <laughs> Thor. Wait, Thor's Chris Hemsworth. I'm pretty sure he's Australian. Never mind. I'm getting the vibe that they did like 15 takes of that joke because the woman on the right 
is just over this bloke. Thor? Wait, Thor's... Chris Hemsworth, I'm pretty sure he's Australian. Never mind. Who has bigger penises, Americans or Australian? <laughs> and oh, then European on. boys on top of that. Where's Americans on this list? Like, we're just They're getting fucked. Like London boys, Aussie boys, Americans, Asians. She's saying that the city of London is so dense with big dicks that it outranks entire continents and ethnicities. Ding dong, talk about Big Ben. London. Okay. Aussie. Jesus Christ. Arab, American, Asian. And I have some questions about these stats. What about an Asian living in London? And what's the units of measurement on the side? I'm Australian, so I'm supposed to be packing a 40, but judging by this, I got some American in me. I think a girl's British accent is like way sexier. It's like, oh, hello, come to my bedroom. Let's let's have sex. I'd be like, oh my God. But if like an Australian girl's like, oh yeah, mate, let me suck your dick. I'd be like, yeah, okay. Where's he trying to pick up Australian women who sound like that? Is he hitting on chicks in the cigarette line at Woolworths? While I'm waiting for my Winnie Blue 30s, how about I have a puff on your American 20? We are having Australians try their best American accent. Who has the accents? Americans or Australians? Or British people? Wait, who the fuck has the accent? I'm starting to see why it's called simple and stupid. Who has accents? Everyone who can talk has an accent. So I have this bottom paragraph for you if you'd give me your best American accent. Hey there, how, how are you, pal? How, how are the wife and kids? How's the mortgage? Just make sure you have the report on my desk by Tuesday, Steve. I love that the most physical contact this guy has got, all video, has been from a bloke. Hey there, how, how are you, pal? That bloke is doing him a huge favor, drawing attention to that amazing watch that a homeless man gave him when he was depressed. You remember when he pretended to have depression to sell a watch? Hey, my name's Stephanie, and I love going to the club and drinking four locos. Oh my God, that's so mood, hashtag you lit. Uh, hold up, hold up. Is that Danny Gonzalez? Oh my God, that's so mood, hashtag you lit. That is definitely Danny Gonzalez. Don't look that up. Well, that's the video. You just watched it. I'm here in my apartment because I already filmed this video like yesterday. Why does this guy talk so weirdly? Everything he just said didn't need to be said because it was a given. Hello person, you just watched one of my videos with your eyes. I'm not at the beach anymore. I'm in a different location um, because I filmed that video in the past because that's how time works. I think that video actually lived up to its name. It was simple. Do you have names? It was sexy. Hey there, how, how are you, pal? And it was so f stupid. Thor? Wait, Thor's Chris Hemsworth. I'm pretty sure he's Australian. Have you, uh, have you, have you ever watched a YouTube video? Let me know down in the comments. Please subscribe to this channel, Sleepy, Sarcastic, Sad, and hit the bell icon to be notified every time I cry myself to sleep. Good night, kids.